In this video, I'm going to show you how to use FitRoom AI. It's an amazing AI tool that you can use to create AI models, amazing models wearing your clothes. Let's dive right in. Now, this is how FitRoom AI looks. It's very bright and beautiful. And all we have to do is click on start for free. Now you can sign in with any Google account. All right, so once we are in, this is how it looks. It's gonna give us a pop-up with the prices for the different packages it has. And this is a free plan that we are gonna be on automatically. We are going to get 10 credits every month. Okay, so every month it resets back to 10 credits. All right, you can do the other paid options, but we're not doing that for now because we are trying it out to see if we actually like it. All right, so now it has lots of different options you can use. You can um, change an actual model to a different model you want. So maybe you can take a picture of yourself in the clothes and switch it to a more high quality model. You can also do a flat lay where you just have the clothes themselves and then you put it on a model or you can use a mannequin if you have a mannequin. Now, a lot of people don't have mannequins, so we're going to go with flat lay clothes today. Right now, let's click on that and select the outfit. Now, if we click on it, we can select the outfit we want. I want this really cute mini dress. That's what we're going to be using today. The AI is going to take some time to process the image that you have put in. So we'll just wait it out. In my description, you find a link to the free plan. Okay. All right. So now the dress is in, has been analyzed and it's kind of put it up over here. Now, single clothes is for like one piece items, like maybe a dress or like a onesie and then top and bottom. It does top and bottom as well, but we're going to go with single clothes today because this is a dress. Now over here, we're going to select what it is. It's a dress or a suit, which is fine. And then the fits, it gives you a loose fit or a regular fit. So we're going to scroll down and select a model. Now fit room has some models that you can get for free. So as you can see, all these models can be used for free. I think if you go for the paid plan, the list of models improve. And also you can create your own model. Now I'm going to go with their models for now and take a look. Okay. So the various options to choose from, I guess I want a full image so i'm gonna go with this with this model now that the model has been selected all we need to do is choose if we want the image to be in high quality or regular quality so one more credit will be taken if we go for high quality but let's just try it out and see how it looks okay and all we have to do is click generate that's basically it. Upload, select model, click generate. So now we're just going to sit here and wait for the image to be ready. And in no time at all, we have a picture of a model wearing an outfit. This is pretty cool. So I'm going to download this image and then I'll take my time and look at it. It does have a watermark at the bottom right over here, which can easily be removed, but let's just download the image and take a look. Since we are using a free plan, we are going to take it with the watermark. In previous videos, I've showed you how to remove a watermark on an image using an AI tool as well so you can check the link in my description for that video link to that video as well all right so now let's take a look at this image okay so this is the picture this is definitely the dress um the, this is supposed to be high quality but i wonder um I don't think the quality of this image is that high because I, as I keep going closer, it kind of pixelates. So the quality is a little questionable, but for online, for social media, for like screens on small devices, this is perfectly fine. 
I like how the dress is on her and I like the fact that she's smiling. Some of the AI models are so straight faced. They look a little weird. So yeah, so this is pretty cool. And might I say this generation was very fast. So we're gonna try another one. All right, now let's try and work out something more for men. So I'm gonna remove this outfit and I'm gonna add another outfit. Let's look for like a men's shirt and see how it's gonna go. Now sometimes I try to push AI a bit too far <laughs> just to see if it will break. And so I'm gonna take like a, dub a layered shirt for this one. So what this is, is a long sleeve shirt with a t-shirt underneath it. And let's see how it works. All right. So now, so now with this outfit, I'm going to go for loose fit. We just want to try things out and see how it looks. This it's selected top, which is correct. And I love it already because the AI can't figure things out on its own. And so this is, since it's a men's product, we're going to scroll down to the male models and try and find a male model for this one. Now bear in mind that the bottoms the person is wearing in this image is going to be what they're going to be wearing unless we upload another image for bottoms. But let's... So let's try and see what we can do. So we need something that kind of complements the outfit over here. Ooh, why is this difficult? All right, let's go with this model over here and let's select this model. And we are not going to go for high quality. I want to see how the low quality option is like. So we're going to keep it at one credit and not select that. And just like before, we're just going to hit generate. Fish room is really easy to use, trust me. So we wait and then we'll see what we get. Fantastic, I absolutely love it. I mean, I don't see it up close, but I think it, it nailed it. So now let's download this. We're gonna download it with a watermark, which is fine. And we're gonna look at it up close. Wow. Um. I see the detailing in there and somehow I prefer this to the other one. I like it. I like it. This is exactly the outfit. It's the t-shirt under and then the green shirt on it. Um, I like that we selected a model that had bottoms that complemented the shirt so it's not looking weird. This is perfect for e-commerce. To be honest so the only thing we have to worry about i guess is the watermark if that really bothers you you know so you can take it out with any ai tool or you could just crop the picture whichever one works for you is fine i really like it i'm not sure how low this one looks in quality i don't know i feel like the quality is fine but oh well, it may be an issue of file size and etc. So this, as I said, perfect for social media and all of these other purposes. All right, thank you for watching this tutorial. If you would like to use Fitroom, just go straight to my description. You see the link to Fitroom over there. And also check out other videos I have. I have a lot of tutorials for different AI tools for fashion and they're amazing. Thanks for watching. Bye.